ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਮੇਰਾ ਨਾਮ ਪੁਸ਼ਪਿੰਦਰ ਕੌਰ ਹੈ ਐ ਤੇ ਅੱਜ ਅਸੀਂ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਯੈਸ ਦੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਲੈਸਨ ਕਰਾਂਗੇ ਸੋ ਗੋ ਹੈਡ ਐਂਡ ਗੈਟ ਯਰ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਯੈਸ ਰੀਡਰ ਫਾਰ ਲੈਵਲ 1 ਐਂਡ 2 ਐਂਡ ਐਂਡ ਵਿਲ ਗੈਟ ਸਟਾਰਟ ਵਿਲ ਨੀਡ ਵੇਟ ਪੈਨਸਲ ਆਲਸੋ ਓਕੇ ਸੋ ਅੱਜ ਅਸੀਂ ਲੈਸਨ ਕਰਾਂਗੇ ਲੈਸਨ ਨੰਬਰ 18 and it is the vowel sound is the vowel sound u mm, that's made by the matra um the um, the lankard so a few things about the lankard are that um the lankard is uh, written below a letter it is um extends to the whole length so if i say the letter is ura it extends to the whole width of it and it's written below the letter and it makes a sound ooh like two o's um in english and um the exception is that ada and ed ada and ed cannot take the the lankard so you've been learning that these three letters ura ada ed are very special very picky very choosy letters they don't accept every matra each letter accepts only three matras do you, you know that you remember that right so ura only accepts ura u ura u ura o that's all it accepts ada can be used by itself which is called mukta ada ada a ara a and ara au so it makes a short vowel sounds ed cannot be used without a matra ed i ed i and ed a right so lama is not used here and here bihari is not used here and here sehari is not used here and here onkard and the lankard are not used here and here so they are very picky in that sense however all other letters of the pentiakri can take every matra theek hai so you have to just remember this one so here are some examples with the um matra the lankard right so this one is school 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 a u u a lu a lu a lu is a potato okay maharni let's say maharni ura u s s s ha ha hu kakaku kakaku gagagu kagaku ngangangu cha cha chu cha cha chu ja ja ju cha ja chu nya nya nyu tenga tu ta ta tu da da du da da tu na na nu ta ta tu ta ta tu da da du ta da tu na na nu pa pa pu pa pa pu ba ba bu pa ba pu ma ma mu ya ya yu ra ra ru la la lu wa wa wu ra ra ru sha sha shu kha kha hu ga ga gu za za zu pa pa fa fa fu Okay now it sounds funny but this is the most important thing you can do to learn the Punjabi language and its sounds and all the matras this is called moharni okay make sure you say moharni for every matra every day for the next 10 days and i promise you will memorize each one of those matras okay now let's practice so here are some words four words kada kadi a uh, padi uh, but the surge right now these are words um, some nonsense some some good words now you have to put the lankard on the first letter and then we will make new words so this one is kada kada is the one you wear here kada right then you put the lankard and you will say it kuda kuda means garbage padi padi means like padi right puri you know puri that you eat with puri chole or puri alu it's a fried bread right but but is the english word right but means par right boot boot is shoe sarj 
surge is an English word like power surge, right? When electric current is too too uh, high. Um, and this one is suraj. So this is how you can change words from mukta words or other words to dulankar words, right? So let's learn some more words. This is vocabulary. You need to learn how to spell them and you need to know what they mean. Chuta, chuta munda, chuta banda. Kuda, garbage. Ullu, owl. Katura, is it puppy? Chuti, chuti kudi, chuti aurat. Buha, door. Chuha, mouse, male mouse. Chuhi is a female mouse. So in English, it's just mouse, but in Punjabi, we are specific with gender. Sur, pig. Surni would be pig, uh, female pig, the so, I think. Um, chut, lie. Tarbuj, watermelon. Karbuja is a melon. And karbuja can be many times types, right? So now, write these Punjabi Moharni sounds. These are Moharni sounds. This is su, shu, zu, du, hu, bu, pu, chu. So um, pause the video and go ahead and write the Punjabi uh, sounds for that with the lenkar. Okay. Now, I want to tell you something special about this lesson. Is that in this lesson, we only use the letters and the matras you have learned so far. So reading these sentences should not be difficult for you. Um, you know, you should know all of the letters, all of the matras used in this lesson so far. Nothing that we haven't learned is used in here. So make sure you can read these words, these sentences. Now I will tell you what they mean. Some of you may not know what they mean. Chuha. Mere kar vich ik juha hai. I hope you don't have a juha. I don't either, but I just made a sentence. Chuhe. Chuhe da rang kala hai ke pura. So chuha can be gray color, can be brown color, can be chitta, or can be kala, right? Or there's a mistake. Chuhe ba, it says. Chut. Chut bolna bohad galt gal hai. So to say, kadi chut ni bolna, chuthe ni banna, take it. Chutha. Chut bolna wala pai, chutha hai. The chutti, chut bolan wali bibi, chutti hai. Right? So hope you don't know too many people who are chutti and chutti. Buha, buha khol de, open the door. Pook, pook mar ke mombati buja de, pook maro. Poot, ki tu si kadi poot dekhya hai? Halloween te dekhya hai? Dur, mera kar gurdware de naal hai, dur nahi. It's a mistake. It says Danal. It should say Danal. Fajul. Fajul which naam bol. Fajul means I mean, well, extra like wasteful. Okay. Boot. Boot ta tasma khol ke boot la. Some people uh, take their shoes off without opening the shoelace, right? So this is saying tasma khol, fir shoes utar. Khun. Lala lal khun. Lal lal khun nikal raha hai. There's a mistake here. It says lala. It should say lal lal khun nikal raha hai. So in Punjabi, we say two of the same words again and again to emphasize what we mean. Lal lal khun nikal raha hai. School. Khun kada nikal hai? When you have some uh, cut, right? Suraj. Suraj asman vich chamak raha hai. Puri. Puri swadi hai. Okay? So um, these are the sentences that have lankar in them so read them one more time and then home for homework you are going to write the sentences same word sentences and words here and you will copy them so why do you need to copy them so that when you read them when you speak them when you write them you will remember them and that's one way of learning a language by practicing so if you can write write more than two times also so read the words read the sentences and then record them Make a video, make an audio, and send it to your teacher. So I hope you remember uh, the uh, the Lankard sound. And um, next week, we will learn a different sound. So thank you so much for working hard with me. And uh, make sure you read the previous lessons also so you don't forget. And keep on working on Punjabi five to seven minutes a day. And pretty soon you will know all the Punjabi you need to learn to be a fluent reader. Vahigurji ka khalsa, Vahigurji ki fateh.